Hello guys, here is Shivli and you are welcome to my kitchen. Today I am going to show you three different types of lassi recipes. Lassi is a uh, drink made from basically curd. In India, it is a very popular drink during summer season. I am going to show you three different types of lassis. The first one is the basic lassi, basic sweet lassi. The second one is kerry lassi, that means green mango lassi. And the third one is ripe mango lassi. All of the three are very amazingly delicious and so much soothing during this summer season. So guys, don't forget to try them. At first, I am going to show you the basic meaty lassi. Meaty lassi means sweet lassi. It's a very easy and quick recipe and without flame recipe. So for this recipe, I am taking 300 grams of fresh curd. For two glasses of lassis, I am taking 300 grams of curd. I am taking one bowl of ice and uh, sugar according to taste. I think actually two tablespoons of sugar is enough for one glass of lassi. So these are the things we need to arrange and now we need a blender jar. I am taking a big blender jar and adding the curd at first. And the sugar. I am taking 4 tablespoons of sugar for 2 glasses of lassi. Now we need to run the mixer for a while until the sugar is dissolved nicely. So it's done. Sugar is nicely dissolved. And now I am going to add the ice. I have taken enough quantity of ice. So we don't need to add any water for this. We need to run the mixer for another while. And it's done. Our basic meaty lassi is ready. You can see the consistency guys. It's quite thick. And there are some ice chunks in it. It's really amazing to drink. And now I'm going to make a, a basic meaty lassi. And another one I'm going to make it spicy. So let's take the glasses for serving. I am taking two glasses for two different flavors. The first one, I am going to make it plain, basic. I am not going to add any flavor in it. And the second one, I am going to add flavor, that means spices. So, in this glass, I am adding one four teaspoon of black salt and about half teaspoon of chaat masala. This is the only spices for this lassi. And I added a very little quantity of water in it and mixing it very nicely so that it can be lumps free. It's done. So guys, now we need to add the lassi in the glasses. This one will be spicy lassi. And this one will be plain basic sweet lassi. Both of them are very yummy and delicious to drink and so much soothing during this summer season. So, don't forget to try them. Here are they guys. So guys, try this simple recipe at home and enjoy. Our next recipe is Kerry Lassi, that means green mango lassi. So guys, for this recipe, I am taking uh, 5 green mangoes. I am going to make it in big quantity and store it in freeze. So I have taken 5 green mangoes and now we need to peel them off. Before peeling, I washed them properly as you can see. After peeling, we need to cut it into pieces. I mean actually we need to take the pulp of it. So I am doing it this way. I am taking all the muscle part of the mango from the seed. So all of them are done. Now let's go for the pan. I turned the heat on and now I am adding some water in the pan. We need to bring it to a boil. So I am covering the pan for some time. And now it starts to boil very nicely. Now I am adding some salt in the water. And now I am adding the keri. That means green mangoes. I add only a uh, half teaspoon of salt in it, not so much. After adding curry, we need to cover the pan for some time. 
the heat should be on low now and in between we need to uncover the pan and stir it nicely so after about 10 to 12 minutes the green mangoes are very nicely cooked as you can see so now i'm going to add some sugar in it i'm adding about one cup of sugar in it it's not enough for this this quantity of green mangoes but I'm adding only this quantity of sugar now and later I'm going to add more as needed. So now we need to mix everything very well. We need to wait for some time until the sugar is nicely dissolved. And now the sugar is nicely dissolved and I am turning the heat off. Now we need to cool it down fully. So I'm leaving it for some time to cool down. And now the mixer is very nicely cooled down now. So now we need to blend it into a nice smooth mixture. So I'm taking a blending jar and adding the mixture in the blending jar. Actually, I'm going to make a green mango pulp base for any kind of sherbet or any kind of drink that is made of keri, that means green mangoes. For example, mocktail, lassi or ampana that is very popular in India. So guys, uh, our basic mango pulp is ready. Now we need to transfer it into a container and store it in the fridge. So I'm taking a container and transferring the mixture in the container. You may store and use this mango pulp for about one month in normal refrigerator. And you may enjoy any kind of green mango drinks such as ampana, lassi or mocktails. So guys, it's okay. I'm covering the jar and storing it in the fridge. After making this, 7 days has been passed. So after 7 days, I'm going to make the lassi. I'm taking a blending jar and here is our mixture, mango pulp. It's half now. Half of it is finished. I'm adding the green mango pulp in the blending jar. I am going to make 2 glasses of lassi, so I am adding uh, 4 tablespoons of the mixture, 2 tablespoons for each glass and now I am adding some curd, fresh curd, about 250 grams of fresh curd I am taking and now sugar according to taste. I am adding about 4 to 5 teaspoons of sugar for 2 glasses of lassi. And for a nice flavor, I'm adding half teaspoon of uh, rock salt and one teaspoon of chaat masala and some ice, ice cubes. And now we need to cover the jar and run the mixer for a while until the sugar is nicely dissolved and our lassi is ready. For a nice great flavor, I'm adding some pudina, that means mint in the glasses. And now we need to pour the mixture, that means pour the lassi in the glasses. So guys, our super tasty, super delicious and soothing keri lassi is ready. Don't forget to try this recipe in this summer season. It's so much soothing and everyone will like it. And our third recipe is ripe mango lassi. It's a very easy and quick recipe. So guys, let's start. For this recipe, I'm taking one bowl of mango and one glass of fresh curd. I am going to make 3 glasses of lassi, so I am taking 1 glass of curd and some ice cubes. Let's start the main process. For this process, we need a blending jar. In the blending jar, we need to add the ripe mango pieces. It's about 1 and a half cup of mango after cutting. And now, the curds. Sugar according to taste, about uh, 6 teaspoons of sugar for 3 glasses of lassi and ice cubes. Now we need to cover the jar and run the mixer for a while until the mangoes are nicely blended and the sugar is dissolved and it's ready as you can see. And I'm going to make the mango lassi in 3 different flavors. So let's go. I'm taking 3 glasses for 3 different flavors. 
the first one will be the basic mango lassi and the second and the third one will be flavorful so i'm leaving the first one and in the second one i'm adding about 1 4 teaspoon of uh, rock salt black salt actually for the third one i'm adding 1 4 teaspoon of black salt and half teaspoon of chaat masala and that's all so we need to mix it very nicely i'm taking a very small quantity of lassi and mixing it nicely uh, for a better result, I am adding some water to dissolve the uh, rock salt. And for the third one, I am adding some water and mixing it nicely for a lumps free solution. After mixing well, we need to add the lassi in the glasses. The first one is basic mango lassi. The second one is black salt mango lassi. And the third one will be mango lassi with black salt and chaat masala flavor. All of the three are very yummy and delicious to drink. So don't forget to try them. Now we need to mix the spices very well with the lassi. It's done. For the second one, I'm going to take a different spoon and now mixing it very well as well. So guys, our ripe mango lassi in three different flavors is ready. Now I'm going to garnish it with some tutti frutti. You may add some uh, mango chunks to garnish it, but I'm adding some tutti frutti on it to look it more delicious. Orange color and red color I am adding. They are my homemade tutti frutti actually. So guys, it's ready. Try this simple recipe at home and don't forget to share your experience with me. Hit the like button guys if you really liked the video and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. Hope to meet you in the next video. Bye bye.